Hi there, Christine with Cam Smarts. So Valentine's Day is coming up. You bought something already? Do you know what you're going to get your special someone? Or are you scratching your head for ideas? Well, I have some suggestions. If your special someone is an outdoorsy person, my suggestions are based on the idea of having a theme. So you think of some aspect um, of whatever it may be, camping or uh, snowshoeing or whatever survival, whatever it may be, and you pick it as a theme and then you just buy uh, different uh, items that have to do with that theme and then you put it together in a basket or in any other um, container that would uh, put them, uh, bring them together in some, uh, in some way. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to show you a basket that I've put together and it's not wrapped uh, so you can see it easier and then I'll put some links below um, with, uh, with different YouTube channels, different uh, videos that are out there on how to wrap uh, a basket. So one of my suggestions is something like this where it's um, about all about cooking. So the camp kitchen, let's say, could be your theme for this. So basically what I did was I went to the dollar store and I purchased a basket and I purchased, you know, some corny little uh, Valentine's Day decorations and things that would put Valentine's Day uh, into this theme as well. Things like this little flower, fake flower, heart arrangement, whatever you want to call it. Uh, you know, some cinnamon hearts, um, some heart-shaped chocolate. Um, basically, just something to put um, a Valentine's Day into this uh, theme. I'm going to bring you closer and, uh, and look at this basket. And then um, I'm going to uh, also talk about a different basket, show you how I would put it together, and, and then talk about some other ideas as well. Okay, so this is the basket that I put together, uh, just as an example. And uh, these are things that I, I personally own. And I just put it together as, uh, as an example of how these things are all within the same theme. And uh, obviously it's nice for you to use your own imagination and uh, obviously to get whatever the person needs or wants or, uh, or that you think that they might want. So what I have here, and I'm going to just quickly go through all these things, is um, I've got little things like, you know, the cinnamon hearts and there's lots of these little chocolates. I just sprinkled them uh, on top. I uh, put in here um, these tablets, these electrolyte uh, tabs that you uh, can add to your uh, water and they definitely make it taste better and, and you get electrolytes and all that good stuff. This is a little uh, platypus bottle that, um, that you can use to carry uh, wine uh, or any other drink. So it's nice if you want to take some alcoholic beverages with you. This is a spice missile and I've got different things in here myself. Oh. More chocolate. I'm going to remove this. And this was probably the corniest thing I could find but it's just something that you know if you want to attach balloons to it or um, I don't know, a teddy bear, something that makes it more, Hall more, um, God, I was going to say Halloween, <laughs> more Valentine's Day. Um, so this is a towel. This is a um, microfiber towel from uh, Sea to Summit. So I use this um, in my camp kitchen myself. So that's the one I use to uh, wipe uh, dishes and stuff. A spork you can never have too many sporks and this is a MSR and it's a foldable spork. More chocolates. Um, in here I've got my Sea to Summit uh, kitchen sink and uh, this holds 10 liters. It's more than enough. They, they make a 20 liter one but I find this is more than enough. Uh, back here I've got also some Sea to Summit um, X bowl, mug and cup. And these are great because they, they are expandable. So I've got the mug, 
the bowl and the plate. And the plate, you can actually use it as a chopping board as well, which is uh, quite nice. In here, I've got the Esbit uh, stove and pot. For those of you who don't uh, know it, I'm going to still have it all wrapped up. But basically, it's the pot and the lid. Um, also, you can also use the lid as a little pot. And it comes with the uh, stove inside, an alcohol stove. You can also use uh, Esbit cubes. So I've added the Esbit cubes in here as well. At the bottom, I just placed some um, tissue paper. And you can put as much as you need to make it nice and, and fluffy to create it as a base for whatever you're putting together.